Good day. In this video, we are going to learn about the Poisson distribution and we are going to use the graphic calculator to calculate the probability of the Poisson distribution. So what are the conditions necessary for it to be a Poisson distribution? Often called the distribution of rare events, it are events that are often defects, accidents or unusual natural happening like cyclones, flooding, earthquakes. So the, the event could occur at any time and in theory there is no upper limit on the number of occurrence. The Poisson distribution is discrete, meaning that the probability can only take discrete number, whole number values of x are only possible. So the probability distribution function or the formula to calculate the Poisson distribution is probability of x equal to x equal to e, uh, e to the power of minus lambda, lambda to the power of x divided by x factorial. So without further ado, let's do some example using the graphic calculator and see how to calculate probability of a Poisson distribution. Okay, so we will put the graphic calculator here and hopefully you can see the lighting. Okay, so I adjust the lighting a little bit so that it make it brighter. Okay, so, so the question is the average number of ambulance that passes through Victoria Avenue in a week is 5. So lambda or nu is 5. Find the probability that exactly three passes through Victoria Avenue in one week. So the x is three because that's what they're asking you. Exactly three passes through Victoria Avenue every week. So in Boson, you need two variables: x equal to three and nu or lambda equals to five. So to do this, because they are asking a specific number three, exactly three passes, you have to use PPD. If it's a cumulative, then you do PCD. So we'll do another example on PCD later on. So in this case, it's going to be PPD. So first, go to your graphic calculator, go to stats, which is the second button there. Then you press the execute button. Now you go to distribution, which is F5. Now there's no Pose on there, so you have to press the F6 button, there's an the arrow there to show that there's more distribution. So F6 will go on, and then now you see Poison, P O I S N, then you press F1. When you press F1, there are three functions PPD, PCD, and inverse Poison. So because I told you this is the point, they ask you exactly three passes through each week, so you have to do PD. I always remember P as a point and C is the cumulative. So in this case, it's a point, so we do PPD, which is F1. Once you have done that, you have to make sure you are in variable. Variable, you have to press F2 to be in a variable mode. Once you're in a variable mode, you just need to enter, and X, is, as I said before, X is going to be 3, and then your execute, and your new is going to be 5, that's the mean, and then execute, and then execute again, and the answer is going to be 0 0.1403. That is how you calculate the Poisson distribution. Okay, so now we are going to do a cumulative. Okay, the cumulative looks slightly different. Okay, so the example 2 looks like that. Okay. So we are going to readjust our calculator. So I'm going to set the menu again, okay? I'm going to reset the calculator. So I'm going to, so that you can understand it better. Go to system, F5, F2, F1, and we are ready to go. Okay, so we are back to menu. Okay, so we are now on average, a household receive one wrong number telephone call per day. Calculate the probability that they receive less than three wrong number a week. So if we, the new is one per day. So if you want to do per week, new becomes seven because one day is one, a week becomes seven. So that's why your new equal to seven. Because they say less than three, you are calculating the probability of x equal to zero plus x equal to one and plus x equal to two. Okay, so you are accumulating from 0 to 2. So in this case, you are going to do PCD. Okay, PCD in your graphic calculator. So what you do again, go to steps as usual, then you go to distribution, F5. There's no binomial, go to F6 to get more. And then now you go to F1, pose on. Okay, this time you have to do PCD. PCD is F2. And then now again, we're going to input the data. Because you are inputting variable, so you put F2 first, variable, and then you're going to put X. Because you're going to start from 0 to 2, that's where it ends to, so X equals to 2, 
and then your new is the what you have done new equal to seven because once a day seven a week so new is going to be seven and then press the execute and execute and the probability is the probability of x less than three means zero one two is zero point zero two nine six and that is how you calculate poisson distribution using the graphic calculator hope you understand how to use the graphic calculator if you have any you are, when you are in doubt please message me in the comment below and i'll help you soon hope you have a good day and enjoy your level three statistics cheers